Hey everyone, Despot here, and welcome back to. <laughs> Sorry, it, I'm not gonna be able to make this joke too many more times, so I thought I'd better get it in now. Welcome back to Paper Mario: The Origami King. Last time we don't talk about last time. Uh, we had a long episode where we finally made it to Spring of Rainbows and got Bowser Jr. all healed up finally. And uh, nothing else happened in the last episode. Nothing of note. Nope, not at all. Nope. Uh, this time, before we move onward, I kind of want to see if I can get into a battle somewhere. Yes, I know about the treasure. Is there a, is there a guy up here still? Ah, there is. Just gonna walk into you. Is there something I kind of want to show off? You might notice that we have Bowser Jr. here in our party. I kind of want to screw this up, but... Admittedly, I might, because I'm not fully sure how to solve this, at a glance. <laughs> you go there. That's ah, screw it. I'll, yeah, I'll screw it up. Uh, let's at least get rid of one row. Or not get rid of one row. I'm purposefully screwing this up. Just so we can see the partner's attacks, and hopefully Kamek doesn't nuke them all. Kamek nukes those, and Bowser Jr. gets to attack with Tantrum. It's pretty good, it hits all enemies in a row, but it's uh, kind of weird. And I don't mean the move itself, I mean Bowser Jr. as a companion. Out of all the companions in the game, you might never actually see Bowser Jr. attack. You wanna know why? This is one of the only opportunities you actually get to use him. It's kind of weird, but... Yeah, you, we have... This is the only time in the game we have a second companion like this as well. So it's kind of weird that we don't get more screen time with him. It's also kind of weird that we don't get him until now. Just saying. Like, he would have been... Like, having two partners in this area would have been very useful. Anyway, let's see if we can finally do something about the approach here. There. You, do you see? That floated soldier atop that cloud. We must take him out. I got it! I got it! Get in, guys! Alright, Mario. I trust you can handle this. If you need me, I'll be quivering off to the side somewhere. Battle time! Not just any battle. Boss battle time! Yeah, you thought we were gonna get out of like a mid-boss -bo battle in this area, but nope. Just because we're done with the elementals doesn't mean we're done with the boss fight. This doesn't look like an ordinary folded soldier, Mario. It's crackling with energy. What? Where did all these little guys come from? They're so cute! <laughs> Do you think they're related? I mean, they must be called Sumo Bros for a reason. They're the littlest little bros I've ever seen. We can go a little easy on them, right? No. <laughs> so, I'm in front. I don't remember anything about this fight <laughs> from my first playthrough. Other than it was kind of interesting. Whoa. What are these? Oh. Right, they steal some of them. Hey, that's cheating! Those little crooks stole the most important panels! I can't believe I called them cute earlier! Give us back our panels! Those aren't toys, you know! Thunder Guard. Ah, uh, that means we can't walk through that area, or at the very least, we'll take damage if we do. Also, yeah, no Bowser Jr. in this fight, I know. I don't know why there would have been, but... Uh, but yeah, we need to focus on getting those panels back, meaning we need to attack them. We should probably start with that on panel, if I had to guess. Yeah. Okay, I might need to rework this. Let's see, if I just go straight... Hmm. 
Hmm. What if I do... Here, now we're in business, I think. That'll take me... Oh, wait, no, that won't work at all either. Oh, wait, now we're in business, I think. Let's try this again real quick. That'll take me around. That'll take me around again. Like, wow, around. But then that'll take me straight into the middle, I think. Let's, I hope. We're going to be going way around. But we managed to dodge everything. To beat the photo associates who are holding the missing panels to get them back. Yep. How strong are they? Sumo bro. These, they've got to be somewhat strong. Also, they have a spike on their head, so I'm just going to assume jumping is not really in the cards here. Let's try a shiny hammer, and maybe that'll be enough. This is the first boss fight where the bosses basically had minions. Ooh, that wasn't anywhere near enough. And they shifted positions. We should probably still focus on the one that has the on switch, since that's the one we already started damaging. It'd be nice if we had any good AoEs right now, but that's not happening. Okay, so let's set that there. That'll take me... That'll take me to the Velemental. Which might be just as good, actually. With, especially with the times two. There's also the turtle one. Hmm. We could make use of that, but we need the on switch for it. I don't know why we have the fire elemental here. The earth elemental I can understand. There's no way that hits the boss, but it definitely could be used to clear out these guys. I'm not sure what the fire elemental is here for. I guess we have to use that on the boss. Maybe we can hit them. We can't hit them at all right now, so... Ah, Flashy Hammer. We know the Shiny Hammer didn't work, and even with the times two, I don't want to chance it. Plus, we have a few of these lying around now. More than enough. Oof. Okay, so let's... Let's go back to the, uh, on switch. So, if I go this way, that'll take me right to him, actually. That works. Let's do this. Yeah, this one, I do remember this boss fight being kind of fun. Not that the other boss fights haven't been fun. I'm gonna be honest with y'all, though. Every boss fight in the game so far has been really cool. Like... Be, I'm gonna be perfectly honest. As far as the battle system of this game is concerned, it's kind of a hit and miss for me. But the boss fights? Those are cool. Except for the Ice of Elemental. We don't talk about the Ice of Elemental as a boss fight. But all the other boss fights, they're actually pretty fun. Albeit, they really are boss fights because of how much time they take. But they are fun. Okay, so that'll take me... Actually, we don't even need to do that anymore. We could... We could use the Earth Elemental to s smack all the ones on the ground, but I don't think that's... I don't think that's in our best advantage right now. I think we should go for the... for the Phoenix, actually. We can place the card here in the way, just in case. Use the magic sticker to defeat them. Does it matter what? Which one? Or hmm, I'm gonna I'm gonna go with the fire one because that should at least hit either the ones in the air or all of them. Whereas the ground one probably only hits the ones on the ground. Or this might also only hit them on the ground. Okay, it also only hits them on the ground apparently. But at least we have the panels back to use. Ooh, I need to heal. Do I use an item or do I use the toads? Or do I just try and grab that convenient heart on the field? Oh, they're on the ground again. And they stole some of the panels. 
And of course, there's still the summon ones. Push, shove, in, win. Oh, let me try that. Push, shove, win. I don't know why I read that as in. Weird shout. Weird pose. Call the hunch, but I think it's about to do something weird. Okay, I definitely need to heal then. God, none of them are over there. The on panel won't help me here either, because we don't have any elementals ready. Well, it looks like I'm gonna hit it anyway. I don't know if this is gonna help me, but we're gonna try it. At the very least, I'm gonna get a decent amount of health. I don't think I'm gonna be able to stop whatever this attack is, but I also at least have the Bellamentals ready now. I can hit him, actually. I mean, I can. I could... Ooh, I also have the POW block. That would hit them all, but I don't think for very much damage. So let's... Screw it, Legendary Hammer. When else am I gonna use this thing? Great! Oh, that didn't damage him much. Oh. Hmm. That was... That was kind of a waste, actually. Good to know. He is beefy and requires developmentals. Meaning I need to get them back. Here, let's... That won't work. Let's do that, and I can use a normal hammer. Because the normal hammer should be able to... Or does... Is that not how it works in this fight? Hmm. That may not be how that works in this fight. In which case... Power block it is. I don't know if this is affected by the double damage thing either. It definitely wasn't. <laughs> that hurt, and he's just gonna keep doing it too. But I am having a bit of trouble getting to his minions. Okay, I'm gonna bite the bullet. Toads, please heal me. Whoa, that is a lot happening. Okay, so that'll take me around that way. That'll take me around and straight in without any movement. So that's... I just can't seem to get any into a position where I can attack. Wait, there we go. I wish I could move that double damage in, but whatever. I can finally at least hit one of them. I don't know how much health they have. Screw it. <laughs> I really need this now, because I don't want this to go on too much longer. Plus, I did hit him as well. So, wow, they have a lot. Uh, they have a lot of health. To be fair, I am screwing up the, uh, the action commands a little bit, but I'm gonna need another heal. They could throw those just a little bit further. Also, 30 health, really? Well, at least that undoes most of his damage. Oh, 
this setup again. This this setup is just bad. Like, what is happening with this setup? Uh, hmm. That's not good. There's gotta be some way to make this work. I can just hit any of them, that would be fine. And that's the closest I'm gonna end up getting. This is kinda hard, and they're not giving me really good options with this. Hmm. Okay, let's let's take a look at this again. If I just go with the flow. Okay, all of those take take me into action immediately, except for that one. But that's still no good. Unless I go for that. Or could I game it and go... Nope, I'm going for the turtle one, apparently, I guess. At this point, either, either Velemental I will accept. I, I think the fire one would burn them immediately to a crisp. But if I, if I have to take the Earth one, I'll have to take the Earth one. Actually, I could stomp on these guys, but I think the Legendary Hammer is my best bet. There we go, I didn't screw it up. Still didn't knock any of them out, but ow! I didn't even attempt to... I didn't even attempt to block that. Toads. Yana, Yana the Drill. I'm bleeding cash for these toads, but, you know, so be it. Hey, I got a fleshy hammer. Hey, and 30 health. That's, that's becoming a problem. Okay, where am I even going? What can I do in the least amount of moves possible? Not that, hmm. That takes me... I really wish I could have got one of these hearts on the way, but... I'll at least survive another one of these powerful attacks. These should be weak enough now, but I don't want to chance it. Shiny hammer. Plus, when am I going to use this thing again? At the very least, the boss has had a good chunk of his health taken down. I actually need to heal now. I think this is the closest we've actually come to legitimately dying. Hey, that's a bigger heart. I will gladly accept that. Okay, so now I just need to hit the panels. I can do that. Wait, where's... Oh, no, right. The, the panels are already on. Yeah, apparently this is where I'm gonna wind up. The closer I am, the more powerful they usually are, although that might not actually apply to the elementals. But I can grab some health on the way, so either way, win-win. Sumo so Bros are weak to fire! Yes, I guessed right. That the, the uh, Earth Elemental probably would have still done a decent amount of damage, but these guys are made out of paper. This is the first time we've actually been able to use the Elemental of Fire against a boss fight that wasn't a thing or another Elemental. Yeah, 
they are very weak to it. 2,000 coins! That's... okay. Well done, Mario. We finally dispensed with those shockingly pesky, pesky foes. Yeah, now there's nothing stopping us from getting in there and releasing the green streamer. Hey, don't forget about saving my dad! And with that, the surprisingly long boss fight at doo da dee da Sale! All battle accessories now 50%- oh. There's a battle accessory shop over here. I might actually buy some of these. Now with the prices, get them while they're hot. These are good. I already have the time one. I think I'm actually gonna go ahead and buy these. I, I've been saving up money for so long but we're getting pretty far in now, and I've, I'm have i starting to have some issues. So Gold Guard Plus as well. I don't even need the silver ones. We've, we've completely bypassed those. With that, though, I think we're going to end it here before we go into Bowser's Castle. Yeah, sorry, but that was a longer boss fight than I was actually expecting it to be. Next time, we're gonna go into Bowser's Castle. Easily one of my favorite areas in the game. Other than Autumn Mountain. <laughs> that was aesthetically my favorite. This is actually my favorite area. Thank y'all for watching. I've been Dashbit, and I will see y'all next time. Take care. Bye! Oh, right, uh... Don't forget to equip your items. Bye!